sitting in a hospital bed, wondering what caused this thing in my head. Thinking of things in the past and science, it goes without saying it causes a dread. The specialist tells us that knowledge is poor, how and when these things occur, no one knows. The symptoms they vary between each and every one. Suffering this disease possibly means no more fun. So why? No one knows. But it's changed my life, and that's a fact. I don't feel like me anymore. I don't feel like me anymore. My body is here, is all out at home. I don't feel like me anymore. We kept in touch with Mark Daly checking upon his hospital appointments, and more importantly, to find out how he was getting on. Eventually, the day of his surgery came around. We watched the clock, seconds seeming like hours, and then finally got news that he was out of surgery and doctors had said it had gone well, and the next couple of weeks would tell us more. A couple of weeks after he came out of hospital, I went to stay with him, and was surprised at how well he looked. So then came the dark days, his slow recovery involving chemo and radiotherapy, each one noted on calendar so we could check on his progress. First you take a tablet, swig it down, then a bag of chemical is brought out, joined onto the cannula, the chemo brunch. sleepless nights praying for good results. People have prayed for me and I'm grateful for that. And maybe it has made a difference. Maybe all of this was supposed to be so much worse and their prayers have reduced the severity. It, who knows? I don't. But if they have, then I'm grateful. It's all fine, we're down down low. Don't you know well, the things we until I Existence as life has changed for me to live one happy existence and what is right. 